SI Instruments suppliers of high quality force and torque measurement equipment. We supply the wine industry, automotive, packaging, food testing, pharmaceutical, plastic, occupational health and safety, research and development and many others. What I am about to demonstrate here today is the use of a barcode scanner with a multi-test XT. The McMesson XT platforms are particularly designed for shop floor operating and therefore the use of a keyboard is often not desired. You can start off with scanning the operator name and password. It is possible to put in things like specimen, batch ID, customer name and so on. The information can also be scanned. All you need to do is highlight the field where you want the info to be entered. On the internet you can find websites where you can actually produce and generate your own barcodes. You can then put them on or around your machine for ease of access. You can also use the barcode scanner in the program itself, but only if you have advanced programming installed on the platform. Once you've installed it, you can use the Empra software to build your own customized programs. Very simply, you pull down the menu. Before you start, you can test zero load and or displacement, then click append. There is your first line of programming. But if you now use a barcode reader, what you can do is use the enter statement as a next line. And of course, when you edit, you have a different set of pull down menus to choose from. You can use an enter command as a number or a string. Now as a number, it gives you the immediate benefit that it is a digital number where you can put a pass fail or a upper lower limit or if the number is larger than 10,000 do this or lower than 500 do that. You can also use this as a string and then you can basically scan anything there is. So in the title of the enter command, you can simply type scan barcode. And then you can sign that to any of the variables that you have available. For instance, V0 and then click append. Now to finish this, add an end statement, then click append. This is just a program to show you about the barcode scanning, then click OK. The next thing we need to do is have a calculation. We can choose multiple calculations, but in this case we select variable. Edit, select V0, and the text is scanned info. We can't verify result due to it being a string. Then hit append, and that's the only calculation we do for our program here. Then click OK. So now that the program has been brought over to the XT system, you can simply start the program by pressing barcode and run. Since we've started the program, we can simply run the program. Then it says enter command. Whilst running the test, it says scan barcode. All we have to do now is scan the barcode and the test has been done. For further information, please contact us.